All right, I've had some problems here with this carburetor, some corrections from some other viewers on these videos. So I'm gonna to attempt to try to correct some of my problems and explain a few other things as well. Um, so this is the carburetor here, it's upside down. I've taken the bottom of the bowl plug out and I've drained it. Some people are asking about these holes. Um, so this little hole right here, is when you press the primer on this, this is where the fuel comes out on the primer. This is your idle adjustment screw and then this is your main fuel coming through. Uh, so people said I had my bowl upside down and you are correct. And my haste putting this back together, put a few things in backwards. Um, so we're gonna correct that. Um, on this, these little divots you see right here. They are this focus those are supposed to be on the top not upside down so I'll flip it over this direction as it goes back together and I also have <clears throat> uh, this item here in backwards I need to change it over um, so we're gonna go ahead and get that flipped over and then we're gonna get the float back in and we're gonna try to adjust the float all right so what I'm looking for now to have this flip back over I'm trying to set this in here is <clears throat> what I'm looking for is when this flap comes over that this flat piece right here will close the pin because this is sitting upside down so this will slide out letting fuel into the bowl when the float <clears throat> goes up to close this I need this to come down and to push the pin in to close the hole um, so I'm trying to get some clearance here so we can get this to focus. So I need a little bit of space underneath these where they come down and allow enough room to close in here on the bulb, not so much to keep the bulb pushed way down or way crooked. So we're gonna kind of slightly bend those where they look about the same, um, where they almost touch but not quite touch and we're gonna put the bowl in there and see how it looks can't see if it's level but that's what we're trying to do um in there so it'll close the needle without bottoming out on the actual housing first so i'm going to attempt to show you this better this is kind of what we're looking at here on the carburetor being in the correct position uh, with the pen the needle I'm down to open and then going back up to close. So you want to build the needle to come down the float as the bulb drains a lot more fuel to the, into the bulb, but when it goes up to close to stop the flow of fuel going in, um, you need to be able to have the needle stop before it goes all the way to the top. <clears throat> 